Hey guys, Justin here. I'm in Warwick right now and ready to take our next route. I see the bus departs in 30 minutes. <laughs> so I thought it would still take a while to wait for. But we're taking one of the longest routes here in Warwick, which is going to be pretty miserable to take actually. But uh, yeah, it's the 344. Literally the longest route here. Oh my gosh, after 60 minutes, it's still not even actually there. But it's almost there. There's actually like the last stop or something around there. But it goes to Morley here from uh, here at Warwick. It literally takes over an hour, <laughs> around an hour. It loops like literally everywhere. Yes, it loops Alexander Heights, it loops Balladura, it loops Malaga, every single thing. And there's also deviations, but actually for the deviations, it's actually pretty weird because for 344, there's one right here, this one, C, and the other ones are just school deviations. This J is a school deviation, so that's why. We have C here, this is a normal deviation on every day, on weekdays. One only, this direction. But this deviation is not done by the other direction, while there's actually another deviation, deviation from the other direction. This is actually very weird because there are two deviations for this route, but, all de but both deviations are actually one direction only. So that's what they're actually both unique deviations that actually doesn't serve by both directions. This one loops around a Malaga industrial area, and the other one loops something else. I don't remember what it is, but that's basically what it is. But we have to wait for a little while before our bus, and then there's a path transit route, so that's why let's see what bus is going to be. Morning contract have a lot of decent buses after swapping of the route of the buses from Welshpool up. So hopefully it's not a gas bus. I did see some gas bus in the morning. So now there's 32, 3377 over there. That one should be done. Should be doing the 371, which is actually coming in very soon. So that's why. Or the 449 back, but there's also 449 here is actually by path, but all the other routes are all by swan, so that's why. Not the right routes for path here. Well, let's wait for our 344. We'll go all the way through. Thank you so much, EL Bus Transit, for this request here. So that's why according to the caption. Uh, I'll think about the caption while I'm waiting for the bus. Alright, I follow the captions. Long with path. Yes. It means it's a very long route with path and also I like path, so basically like a thing like long long live with path or something like that. <laughs> Just kidding. But now there's a big problem. Yes, there's a big problem. Because there's a gas bus packed back there. And none of the depots up here for Swan has gas bus. So that's why for sure it's gonna be running on path routes here, that gas bus. And then <laughs> now it's just one out of two because for 1042 is both the 344, which is 30 minutes per bus, and also the 371, which is 15 minutes per bus. So they would depart at the same time, but it just depends on which one will be actually the one doing my service. 3377, like I said, left already in the previous 371 service. But there's a gas bus parked behind that lift over there, just behind the lift. And then there's a gas bus. I didn't see what number it is, but probably a base water 18 gas bus. And that's going to be bad because this route is so long, it's going to take years before I can actually get to Morley. <laughs> but let's just hope for not a gas bus, then we can do a faster journey. Nice, not a gas bus. 2787, although not a very good one. And 1885 on the 371. Oh man, that was also pretty long, but not as long as 344. So, right time. Let's do it. This is one of the longest route of all times. So, all the way to Morley via literally everywhere. Alexander Heights, Balajura, Malaga, all the areas. And then loop down to Coventry and then Morley. Now, this is Path Transit. And also with these 2780 series of the buses in Path, they actually changed the, 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 the system at the front. They're no longer using a cage. They're actually having a big old plastic shield over there for the driver, which is actually a little bit of a difference because all the other buses are just cage. It's a big old cage still for the buses. 1885. Ugh. Now, 37 is a unique one because it actually passes through Mirabuka bus station but doesn't terminate. So, that's why. That one goes to Mori as well, 371, but it passes through Mirabuka bus station and then continues to Mori, which doesn't stop and terminate at, three, at Mirabuka, which is pretty, pretty unique. Alright, let's do it. Thank you so much, EL Bus Transit, for this request here. Now, just real fast, EL Bus Transit, you have requested two routes on one form. 
I've already been lenient and I should accept it both and I should swap them both into two forms separately by myself. So, but next time I will not actually accept your form because you request the two routes on one form, only request one route per form. If you want to request two routes at the same time, I'm, I, of course, I welcome, I am welcomed for that. So that means I don't really care really how many you request. Of course, don't spam it, like don't request like five at one time. But if you want to request two at one time, then use two forms. You can submit more than one, so why not Why not actually just split it into two forms? So that's why next time I won't accept your things, okay? 450, trash, 2152. All these 21s are absolutely trash up here. Oh my goodness. All right, let's do it. No one at the front seat, but I'm not doing it at the front seat today because generator set at the back. So, so uh, an estimated arrival is actually 11.40, which departed at 10.42, so literally an hour, which is uh, very bad. If, uh, the, the, this time is uh, not a few, uh, last time I took a future bus, I've taken this route full journey already one time, but the other direction, this time we take this direction, and hopefully, uh, it won't actually be that slow, but it loops a lot. I'm not even joking. It literally loops everywhere. Actually, I always I pass I pass it through here a lot of times. So I never actually seen that. I never actually saw this Warwick shopping center right here. It's actually I've never seen this before. Earlier I took the 445 to try that out, it drove down that path over there, you can see cars back there. And then it stopped, had a stop outside of the Warwick Shopping Centre, but that's it. I actually never knew that there's a shopping centre there. Wow. So bad. Even if it's a big one, because there's Hoyt's there. Hoyt's is a cinema, so that's why there's a cinema inside, so it means it's a very big one. I just have never taken that path, apparently. Okay, unfortunately we got stalled behind by the gas bus at the front, which is not great. <laughs> so, I can show you the map, it literally loops everywhere. Well, this stop doesn't, it's not served by the 371 and 344, okay. I guess there's another stand at the front for it, but... Yeah, I just never actually saw and read on this side of the map, there's actually a stop here. I mean, also a uh, shopping center here, I'm so bad. <laughs> yep, stop here. All right, look at this massacre. Look at this massive thing. It goes up along this, uh, this road and it goes over here. Travels along this area, which is uh, Girarine. And then up to Alexander Heights, loop inside Alexander Heights. This is the miserable part. And then go over to Balajura. There's Balajura right there. So this is basically Alexander Heights and Balajura. And after Balajura loops down to Malaga. After Malaga is down to Noranda. After Noranda is Morley. So, so you see how many areas need to pass through. And I have no idea where the Malaga depot is. It might pass through. So. Now if you just want to go to Malaga, please take the 449. That's the one you should take on weekdays. On weekends, no service unfortunately. But if you just want to go to Malaga, please take 449. It's literally express, very, very express, one straight path through instead of doing loops like this. This is ridiculous. So. Can you walk faster, son of a bitch? Jesus, walk faster. Oh my gosh. Ridiculous. Take this inner path here. Take the 
taking this inner path and turn right to to Warwick. I mean, Warwick, turn right here. Go back on the Warner Road 447. Trash, not that great. That bus 447 is very unique because none. Uh, yeah, it's, it's on the it's on the same stand as the three four four and three seven one, which is kind of off. Why not just put it on the four four five and four four six stand? The stands allocation in Warwick is kind of weird because they put random things all over the place. Quite a lot of people because it's a very useful route. So. My dream of getting like Gavin and Jay during normal days is still not available. That's a cool long long car right there and oh my gosh what the hell. Alright, onto one of the road and then head up to Gearin. Loop inside the suburb. We start the looping process. There's one over road. No stops here. Only a three four three eight nine and a four fifty. I think there are no stops on one over road. I think we just turned right over. Yep. And red light. Unfortunate. All right, cut it out. Turn into Marangaru Drive. I was just about to say something, but I forgot what I want to say. Oh yeah, here. Like last time, I film, sometimes I do film on the right side, but very seldom. Like maybe you guys thinking, oh, why not film on the right side? The first thing is left side. I can actually show you the stops. The right side, I can't. Although the right side has more views, but this side the stops, which is actually more important related. So. And also, this time, this bus has full ads on the right side, so can't do that, unfortunately. 344 four and 448. 448 is just the Kingsway Shopping Centre. That one's pretty lame because it makes a big loop just to go to Warwick Station. But I guess it's something else instead of actually you take 386 all the way to the city. New Park Shopping Centre. This is one of the deviations of the 374 and also the 376 so I, and I don't think it's 376 is it 376? I think it's 376 also with deviates down there which is so stupid they just have to surf the shopping center and there are literally stops around it 374 just set it on the other side didn't see what it is Seven four three eight six turns left. Basically, I want to say it's the three six and three the four four eight. It's literally the same path. It's just basically one four four eight just goes to Warwick and then three six goes to the city. So. really like know that you should you're out of money for your car he was out of money and he didn't know about it so that's why now he's actually just grabbing coins and doing stupid things now oh my goodness at least, at least not gonna cause like serious delays like in the morning today literally ridiculous oh three six twenty nine forty three now let's go to the shopping center terminating Oh, is that going to the shopping center or that one's going to the city? I think that one's going to the city, isn't it? Yeah, that one's going to the city. I think going to the city. Okay, 
exclusive 344. Weekdays 30 minutes. I think weekends is actually one hour for this one. 371 is the higher frequency, 15 minutes on weekdays, 30 minutes on weekends. So I mean it's actually Monday to Saturday, 15. Sunday is like 30 for that one. Future bus. Future bus at the front. 375. 1462. That's a Midvale bus. Oh no 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 that's a Malaga bus because I remember that one. 375 is the odd one. 374 and 376 are by Swan. 375 is by Path. Yes, yes. This is one of the weird ones because 375 doesn't go to uh, Whitfits. 374 and 376 both are Whitfits. That's why it's by Swan. But 375 is Mirabuku to Alexander Heights. That's it. So that's why it is by Path Transit. It's because the whole thing is basically a Path Zone. Instead of actually going to Whitfits, which is actually a Swan Zone. So. Yes, 375, 1462, that's not Vivio bus, that's the Malaga bus. I've saw it a few times on the freaking 960 before. Now, you guys may, but don't, don't forgive me of mistaking that one because there's future buses in Midvale Depot, which is 1470 something. So, including a uh, designated bus for the Midland Shuttle Route 300. Is that one actually free of charge for the 300? I'm not so sure. Mirabuka Avenue. See, turn left. We need to do a lot of loops, that's why. There's that one over there. 360 limited stops to the city, 2359. Awkward number again. I don't remember that one. I, I, I don't know, that one's Malaga for sure, but. I've seen gas buses on it before, but I don't think there are there are, no, there are not going to be any more gas buses for those. Because considering how many they have swapped down to freaking Welsh pool. It's just Bayswater having uh, gas buses right now. The 18 gas buses. A lot of people here. Yep, Miss Alexander Heights. This guy over here. I might need to report him to the driver because he's he's literally sit he just went in, fairly evade already. So I already like the driver already doesn't care because he fairly evade. And as soon as he get onto the bus, he sat next to that lady. And I'm making I can clearly see that's actually making her uncomfortable right now. Because after a while I start to do stupid things, I have to stop us. So Alexander Heights this is the weird part because some of the routes are terminated to Alexander Heights. I actually need to do that roundabout that we just went through there and turns back to the other side, which is actually pretty funny. Literally in the middle of the road and then there's a sign saying, go back, you turn. And this one will continue this loop. We have made it to Alexander Heights and this is the suburbs, looping suburbs in Alexander Heights.
0.61. That one's also Alexander Heights to Perth City, limited stops. Those are the, uh, yeah, those are the three normal limited stops routes that run all day after the 104 and 105 has been cancelled. No more limited stops for 104 and 105. Before it was limited stops, but very, very lame limited stops for 104 and 105 because it literally just skipped like three, like a very little amount of stops. Now 360, 361, 360, mm -hmm. really skips everything, almost everything along the whole road of Alexander Drive. So that's why. But those are the regular limited stops routes. Only three, yes. Others are all just expressed during the uh, rush hours. Like we have the 66 and we have the 385, we have the 370. 370 is the express route of 970. So literally the same path. 66 is 950 express. And we have the 385, which is the 386 express going to the shopping center. Three, uh, three, four, four. I actually slept like around a little bit of the section because I was a little tired, so that's why I didn't actually like stay awake for the whole trip. So that's why. But uh, this time we'll stay awake for the whole trip because I'm not actually doing too many things. Last time I was actually listening to songs while I'm actually taking the bus, and listening to songs can actually give you drowsy. It can actually makes you a little bit <laughs> drowsy, and uh, yeah, it makes you fall asleep. So. Alexander Heights, I think we turn left. Oh no, right. Okay. This is the mi miserable part inside here. Alexander Drive, which is basically Alexander Drive is all the way through from the city all the way up to uh, very very far up. 344 Bendy Bus 3059. Nice. It's just a random driver, it's not anyone special. <laughs> now basic one is depot just around this one and also Malaga Depot, which is both uh, Gavin and Jake, so that's why. 378, I don't remember that one. Turn right. Let's do it. Almost to Balajura, but we're still just inside Alexander Heights looping right now. Oh, that's uh, okay. Because it's limited stops, so that's why for all of the limited stops, 
uh, stops, that limited stops route stops that they actually need to stop at. Because if, if the driver is not familiar with the route, they don't know when to stop because it's not every single stop. So that's why they have that yellow strip on the top of the pole and they are somewhere actually visible to the driver to show that this is actually a stop that you need to stop at. It's the same for the 998, 999 and all these. Oh, actually for limited stops, I kind of forgot about the 998 and 999. <laughs> oh well, that means five normal routes running on uh, during the middle of the day will be uh, limited stops. Okay, we got more pipples. Oh man. Oh man. Three four four to Marangara Drive, three six one thousand turn five, and the three seven eight goes straight. I don't remember what's the three seven eight. I think it's Mirabuka, but I don't remember what it is. Oh well, we're still going straight. It's just I think that's the deviating trip that goes to a school or something. Three sixty now is not three six one. Three six one already turned right, so. For a primary school, there is a deviating trip that actually just goes here, I think. I don't remember clearly, but but yeah. Seven eight goes that way for some uh, over there. Baradura now made it to Baradura. I feel it is actually pretty quick right now, but I don't think it is. But let's see. There's still a lot of areas to pass through, so that's why. Three four four turns left. I don't remember what's actually going straight. Is it a three seven six or something? Oh man, what is going on here? Okay, thank you for this car actually driving out of the way. Good, thank you. Then it's not stopping in the middle of the road, it's gonna be annoying. 344 only here. Morley bus station. One of the longest routes, that's for sure. Except 99899, this should be the longest one this, the in Morley. I mean 955. Uh, which one is longer? 955 or 344? The other ones are all short, so that's why. So that's why. Yeah, I'm not so sure. Yeah, the other ones are all short, it's just going up somewhere random. Except the 955 and 344, literally ridiculous. I'm also 371, but 37 for sure shorter. And uh, what other routes actually in Morley? I don't remember that well, but all the other three, four uh, routes are just short, not long at all. And then we have the uh, 955, that's the one that's actually going all the way up. And of course the circle route, ignore the circle route, that doesn't count. And then we have 950, 980, 48. 48 is also pretty long, but 
Yeah. 20 is short as shit. Within 20 stops, you can actually get the full journey done. And uh, what is, what, what's more? I don't think there are any more actually. I think that's it. And of course, we have the stadium route, but that, that one doesn't count. 37, 8 turns left. The thing is, even sometimes if he's actually having a uh, generator set, I film at the back, and if I've actually got Gavin or Jay randomly in the middle of the day for normal filming, I will for sure film at the front because that's a very good chance that I actually can do it at the front filming without any troubles. More terrible intersections. Hey, what are these roads? Why would we just keep on turning? I know this route loops a lot, but these roads are really, really late. Like, what is this? Oy. Oh. Literally goes through the narrowest of all. After Balajura will be Malaga, along Marshall Road. That's basically where the 449 goes, but we just basically looped a big way around to get to where the 449 is. There's someone here, but that's not a bus stop, so nothing. which is the Balajuru Express limited stops all these I've never tried yet so I need to try them those are gonna be fun because it literally runs through the stops really good so, and I don't know whether all of them all three runs on weekday weekends I think 360 doesn't run on weekends but I think 361 and 362 runs every day Oh my gosh, there's a loop in here. Now the 362, it's just basically limited stops along Alexander, Alexander Drive. Inside, inside these, uh, these areas like this, inside these suburbs looping is basically every stop for the uh, limited stops route up here. 360, 361, 362 is stopping everywhere. So that's why. out of people god damn it you're like oh man this area up here is really uh, uh. like you're already fairly bait annoy that little lady at the front he this, uh, friend of that asshole got on and then he moved up moved up and chat with her and then the uh, the uh, the other lady that he was annoying at the start went up and sit at the front seat which is good for her because then she stayed up there and then when she, when he wants to get off the driver forgot to stop at the stop, and then he stopped after a little while, and then, and then he swear at the driver. Yeah, he swear at the driver for not stopping. Like seriously, you're fairly evading already, so I'm not supposed to serve you. And then you're, you're just like not disrespecting the driver by swearing. 
absolutely, absolute, absolute asshole. But Malaga here, which is just basically an industrial area. I'm not so sure where's the depot. I'm not so sure whether this route will pass through the depot. But uh, there's that route that's 722 from uh, some of the industry areas over here and goes to bus, bus board. That one is a seven route, but non-school students can take it, but only specific people. So basically when you're not a school student, 722, school students can take. Okay, 722, school students can take. Even if it's not needs, literally not next to school, but school students can take 722 because all of the seven routes, uh, school students are allowed to take. Not me, I can't. But uh, for 722, because it's actually for some of the workers working in the industry area, so that's why for workers, they can take the 722. But that's the one and only route that they can actually take <laughs> for the seven. They cannot take anything else. So uh, here's where the 449 actually terminates. It's just, just terminates over there somewhere. So now we go back onto Malaga Road. Not Malaga Road, but the Malaga around here. Where's the depot? I really actually want to know where's the depot. Oh man, this is a long route. We still have a lot of areas to go through before we hit Morley. It's like around halfway through the route right now. Maybe 60% around that. Someone's getting on. Nine goes straight. That's the one straight to Warwick. So that's why. Another one here. Three four four. That's a that's a gas bus. Eighteen ninety two. That's a gas bus. <laughs> oh man. Eighteen ninety two. Eighteen ninety two. Now there are there are new 34s entered service for Transdev Free Metal Depot, which is very, very decent. I don't know whether those are actually the buses that actually have the electronic panels, because they have installed some electronic panels on some of the newer generation buses. They will probably show the map of the route, which is going to be very decent, actually. Of course, there's no point of actually doing like announcements for those buses because who the hell will know about what the name of these stops are? Like what, like Victor, like what, what road after Victoria Road for this stop? Who will know about these? And there's the deviation, turns left for the one that I showed you at the start of the video, going over that way to the uh, industrial area. We're not going in there. The deviations are very confusing for this one, so that's why. Because it's just like different for every direction. This direction only have one deviated, which actually goes into the industrial area in the afternoon, around three o'clock, departing from Warwick. All the other way have more deviations and do more actually in the day. <laughs> so. Someone's getting off here? Or not? Oh yeah. Morning going straight. Continue. This is just your area over here. And drive onto the bus lane. Next is Noranda. Noranda is the same as the 346 and also the 347. These two are literally very, very similar. 346 is the more regular one. It's okay service, not great. That one's literally a pretty trash timetable. 347 is the weird one. Yeah, 347 is literally the weirdest one of all times. 347 is uh, to Morty City High School and that is a route that operates every day. Yes, every day. And it terminates outside of school. Every day. Yes, on Sunday, going to a high school. <laughs> yes. It's just like it doesn't terminate anywhere that is actually useful, so they just terminate outside of the high school. At least they have a banking. At least they have an embankment for the bus. But literally, <laughs> that, that round is pretty pointless, to be honest with me. Good view. 
Oh, the 346 can actually just do it. So the 346 and the 347 terminus is just 15 minutes away with walking. I've walked that one time to try both of the routes in one go, so that's why. The 345 is a good one, it should have re been released and premiered, that one's really decent, the timetable. It might switch to a new high frequency route in the future, maybe 945 or something. Really, really decent. I don't know what they're going to name that one, maybe 965 or 9 feet, not 955, 955 is there, so. Because after Edinburgh Point Road, they might actually go ahead and switch it to uh, the, uh, the high frequency. They might actually switch it to change it to name 955. Because in the future, for sure, I think they're going to switch out 955 and not having a 9 for the numbers. I think they're going to switch it to a different number. Because it's not high frequency at all and having 9 for numbers. So I think they might do the 345 as round 955 in the future. I'm not so sure. I'm just randomly thinking things. Because they might increase the frequency. I'm not so sure about that. So someone said it somewhere. I don't remember. My eyes are so itchy right now. So after I get off, I would just take another bus right back to Coventry, and I would have my lunch at the uh, Tao Tan Tang over there. Bus turns right. I just cut it out. Okay, let's do it. Continue. No idea what this path is. Cramia Street, which is actually I think where the 343 takes. Not so sure about that one, but I think it's similar. But the thing is, we're not even going to go very straightforward over to Morley really quickly right here because we still have a lot of loops to do. So Here 346 doesn't drive by here, so that's why 346 in the suburbs. 346 is an okay route, so yeah. Yep, can I stop? 344, I actually expect it's gonna be 15 minutes per bus, but apparently not. <laughs> so it is just 30 while the 371 is 15 because it's passing Mirabuka bus stations. So I guess that's better, <laughs> but Mirabuka. Uh, uh, the worst bus station in terms of security issues. Everything else is okay. It's just this stupid one. Morley is okay as well, not too bad, because there are like there are transit offices in everywhere, but the Mirabuka one doesn't really actually control that well. But the Morley one is pretty good, they nicely control. One of the other bus stations. Uh, Henley Brook is what, probably one of the safest ones because there's literally no one up there. There's literally no one up there for the uh, for Henley Pro bus station, so of course it's not going to be too many issues. Literally, the whole bus station is like completely empty because for that bus station, no one will actually walk to that bus station. No one will walk to that bus station. There is literally no stops around the bus station except that bus station, and then every other stop is away from the bus station. And then next to the bus station, there's literally zero houses. Like, who the hell will walk there? It's just except people that are going to be driving there, they can actually park there and just take a bus. But seriously, it's like that. So no one's basically been using Henry for bus station. In the future, they will have a train station next to it, so that's why then it will be switched over. But uh, yeah, Morley Drive. So that's why. See our way through. We're almost done with the day, I'm just going to get out now. After that, we'll go back home and do some revision. Need to do a lot of revision because upcoming is exam weeks. I got a ton, so four units. So that's of course all four has have exams, and they're spread out all throughout the two weeks of uh, exam periods. So, oh yeah, the request form. I need to close it off. Walter Road, and we've made it to Morley. Nice, we've made it to Morley because we've made it to Walter Road. This is actually pretty smooth. This time is actually way smoother than last time. Last time has actually some fair evading problems. 
and then those guys all took to Morley, and then I mean not Morley, took to Warwick for those guys, and then the driver re refuses to open the door at Warwick, and then called the transit officer since actually parked on the side with a random car to come <laughs> over, and then he opened the doors. But at the end, the only call that the uh, the transit officers over, they didn't actually the, the transit officer didn't actually check anyone. They just called them over and probably get a ticket on checking how many ferry bases there are. This this sign is really funny. It's turning. It's pretty funny. This Maya is really huge. <laughs> Holy wow, this Myers. This whole building is Myers? Wow, that's huge. Getting off someone? And Morley's at the front. I don't know how long is the video, I didn't check, but hopefully it's within 50 minutes or within at least, hopefully within an hour at least. It seems pretty fast, but of course it's one of the longest routes of all time, so. We're not even at Coventry yet, actually. We still need to go through Coventry, which is at the front. We made it to Morley, so it's a little bit more in terms of red lights. <laughs> so this little intersection, this one is also miserable. And here's a stop for Coventry Village, and then two more stops to Morley bus station. And another red light, of course. Oh. Seven one bendy, thirty sixty two over there. Very nice. Honestly, like three four four and three seven one. Honestly, three seven one actually uses quite a lot of bendy buses. I'm not even joking. It does use quite a lot of bendy buses. Of course, not always, not like nine fifty, but it still uses quite a decent amount. And two more stops. Stuff. Turn left, and uh, I think I think a nine 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 coming up, nine nine eight. I mean, over that way. And here we are at Morley. Finally, it's been a while. <laughs> now, anyone get over this stop here? This stop is actually pretty useful as well. So, all right, next is Morley bus station. The very glorious Mori bus station, which at the end, very soon I think they were gonna be switched to a. Uh, there will be a Mori train station on the Ellenbrook line, so that's why. I'm sure, it's called Morley Ellenbrook line, so of course there will be. I tried to catch one random one to get to the uh, to Coventry Village. There's that 20 over there actually getting ready to go. There's a tons of gas machine. Oh my gosh, 1886, 1885 lined up together at the same time. And a tons of. Uh, Tons of uh, tons of B8s. Oh, 2709, one of the uh, ex Welsh pool buses. I missed this guy. I took him quite a lot of times actually. Transit officers, though, unfortunately, we cut on the bus here. 3787, transit officers got called over because there's like someone saying that they need help on the bus, which probably is that lady that called over because uh, that lady is having some issues, so that's why with that guy earlier on boarded. So that's why, but hope you guys enjoyed this video. Very, very long, but very, very enjoyable this time because not too many issues, except that one dude really, really fucking annoying. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to like and subscribe, click the bell so that you can get notifications when I post. Check out the links in the description down below for my other channels and my Instagram. Click on this video up top, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.